this is Maggie coming to you from IMTS 2016. Since you couldn't be here, I decided we should give you a tour of the booth. So this year we decided to divide up the booth into four quadrants um, to focus on the new machines and the machines that are most popular in the Merco lineup. So first of all, we call this quadrant over here the Automation Quadrant. And it has been extremely busy here at IMTS. We have the HTM30, which is an open bed mill. Um, people have been asking for that for years. We used to have a product called the Hawk that people liked. But what we put on there is our 3D print head. And that is something that's brand new uh, for Herco in the additive space. And you can put that on any Herco, and that way you can prototype from start to finish. And then you can also use it to machine the part. In the automation quadrant, we also have the BMX 24 HSI, our high speed machine that's equipped with an Aroa robot which operates with a pallet chamber. And then the next quadrant that's been extremely popular is what we have become known for, which is our five axis uh, machines. One of the things that we do with five axis is obviously simultaneous five axis, but where the real benefit is, if you already have three axis machines, you can save so much time and increase your profit margin just by getting a five axis machine and using five sided programming. We have a feature called Transform Plane that basically converts it to two and a half D programming that you're used to on our control. So that's where we benefit. And we've grown the five axis line. Right now, um, the new machine down there is the VC600, which is a cantilever design. We also have the swivel head design, which is the SW and the SRT line. And then, of course, the Trunnion, which people here in the United States are more used to. We have the BM10U Trunnion style machine. And then our next quadrant is the three axis quadrant, which um, there we brought two of our most popular machines. The BM line is the general purpose line, so we brought the BM20. And then the BMX6030 is a machine that we specifically made for the mold market. Uh, what they needed, they needed more Y axis travel. So we really try to listen to our customers and find out what they need. So we designed that machine specifically for them. And you'll notice on there that's one of the machines because it's so popular in the United States that we assemble right in Indianapolis and that's been a big selling point for a lot of people um, our new machine in the three axis quadrant is called the BX 40i uh, that machine is a double column machine that has a ladder design and that increases the rigidity it has an 18k uh, spindle and it really can cut metal and it can take deep cuts it's a very rigid machine. Then we have uh, the lathes over here in this quadrant, it's the turning centers, and here we're focusing on the TMX 10 MYS. Uh, that is a slant bed, just all our lathes are slant bed design, which increases the rigidity, and it is um, has a sub spindle and it has live tooling. And then the other lathe is one of our most popular. It's the TM8 lathe. It's a slant bed lathe. Um, a lot of shops pair that up with one of our VM mills to kind of create a cell. Now, as far as the overall theme of the booth, the fun stuff we have going on, um, what you might not know is we start planning IMTS about a year ahead of time. And we talk about all different things and what would be fun for people, but also informative and educational. So we really wanted to drive home the point that we are an Indianapolis company and we have been in Indianapolis since we were founded in 1968. Um, some people don't know that because the majority of our sales are over in Europe. So we got all hyped up about the Indianapolis 500 so we thought let's bring Indianapolis here to IMTS. So our theme this year is Race to Profitability with Herco and we decided to focus at the centerpiece of our booth um, where people could have some competitive fun and they could race our C cars and what's in the middle there is our team's car, uh, Ed Carpenter Racing. We sponsor them. There are two drivers, Joseph Newgarden and the owner of the team, Ed um, Carpenter. So that's the centerpiece. And people have been having a lot of fun and then we have drawings for prizes. And finally, um, another thing we put together for the show that you can participate in too is what we call the VIP Access Indianapolis Experience Sweet Things. So how that works is we're giving away five packages and it was, it's a two-night stay. 
all of your expenses and travel are paid for for you to come to Indianapolis um, and it's for two people and what we're going to do is instead of you know forcing a certain date or you have to do certain activities we're going to build the package around you uh, of course it'll include a tour of Perco so you can see what we do there and meet the people but also we have a lot of uh, sponsors in Indianapolis and a lot of great partners in Indianapolis so for instance if you're a football fan we can get you great tickets um, with the Colts uh, if you are interested in basketball, if you like Big Ten basketball, we sponsor IU and Purdue, and they have you know a great experience there with hospitality. And then of course there's racing, which is what Indianapolis is known for. So you can have a tour of Delara, you can go over to Ed Carpenter and meet Justin Dugard and Ed Carpenter, and see what all the guys do in the machine shop there. Our newest uh, team that we sponsor is NHRA, John Horse Racing, which is, has a really cool facility right down the road from us, and they make um, a lot of their parts, the majority of their parts, on Herco machines, as does Ed Carpenter. So it's really fun to talk to the machinists and see what they do with Herco machines to make those cars go faster. So you can enter that at herco.com forward slash win, and you just fill out the form, and you can enter it there, and then be on the lookout because we're going to keep adding different things that you can do to get an additional entry into the Sweet Six. And that goes through the end of October. So even if you're not at IMTS, you can enter that. And one other thing I wanted to show you in the booth, I didn't want to leave you without um, talking about what we're known for best, which is our control. Um, our control technology is known as the most flexible control in the industry because you can do conversational, which is the gold standard. Um, we're the ones that make it user-friendly and easy to program. You can do industry standard NC with CAD CAM system or G codes, and then we have something called NC Conversational Merge, which takes the best of both of those, which a lot of our users um, have found a lot of use for that in um, taking existing parts and then entering uh, conversational features into it. So NC Conversational Merge is a big one. So what we did at the booth is we divided up in each quadrant there are two uh, demo consoles of our control, and you might remember we came out with the Max 5 last year. And so it's an interactive display. Not only do we do um, demos with people where we step them through, but people can come up and program their own parts right here in each quadrant. So thank you very much for coming, uh, for watching this video about IMTS 2016, and we would love to hear from you. Any ideas you have for IMTS 2018, which is gonna be our big, 50th anniversary um, would be great.